Nice of you to drop in. <laughs> I'm coming for you, Joker. Hey guys, it's me, Bassbot here, bringing you another video, and this time this is a speed art for Pokemon, uh, for Pokemon Day, and I decided to draw a Litten Shoe Not Fire with a Mimikyu on the side, patting its head. I, I just gave it a weird, like a cool glow, like it was like charged up with the Z move or something. And so, I, know, I just felt like doing that for fun. And I haven't done these type of videos in a long time. It might look choppy. I don't know, it looked choppy when I was recording it because uh, sometimes OBS is not my friend, but I made it work. So, normally I'll put in some music in this video, but sometimes when I do do that, I get hit with copyright claims, so I am not gonna put music in my videos in a long, in, in a while. Only if I don't get those problems anymore, but I hope you like what you see on here because uh, it took me about almost two hours to put together the uh, this recording of the video itself, not the audio, but because uh, the video is pre-recorded, so like I took my time after I finished recording just to touch it up a bit more. Like make sure everything blended in, look like it's part of the ground the best I could, cause I made that back one background quick. So, I think after this video is posted, I might um might do a Pokemon stream on Twitch on the same day, Pokemon Day. So I'm gonna be streaming some Pokemon Uranium and some drawings on there. And so if you guys are interested in watching the stream, uh, I'm guessing I'll do it somewhere in the afternoon. Oh, well, I'll be streaming at Twitch if you guys are interested to watch that. Um, when I was doing, but back to the what I was talking about the uh, speed art. When I was doing the flame effect on that, um, I used the illumination. Like I used the uh, the. The the thing you make everything look bright on uh on Psy. so I did that with the flames. So the first layer was red, then yellow, and then orange. But it was a little hard to see it through a bit, so I kept the orange in. But I put a layer of a uh, regular red at the uh at the bottom because I had to make a new layer and move it down. It came out pretty good. Uh, I gave it a little bit of sh more shine, like it looked the fire was brighter, so I just hit it with a, a shine of white. So, that came out really good. So, um, you guys will love seeing this picture. It's going to be posted on my uh, Twitter and uh, Instagram. I mean, not Instagram. I mean, my Twitter and Tumblr, if you guys want to watch, because um, if you see my end card, you see the places where I post, the, 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 will post, because it will show Instagram, I mean, not Instagram, I mean, it will show uh, Twitter and Tumblr for you guys to look at it, the, whatever I have, because I'm not sure I should, am I, I'm allowed to put the link to my Tumblr on there, but... You guys will get to see the finished picture on both those places. And I think the toughest thing to draw was having the Litten pose the way I wanted to because I'm not the best at anatomy, so I tried up my best to get the pose right. But it came out pretty good. I did forget some things while I was in the middle of coloring, like the stripes, the red stripes on Litten. But when it comes to uh, drawing Mimikyu, um, for some reason I thought it was going to be hard, because normally when I was when I did drew it in my sketchbooks, uh, what are my sketchbooks? Um, they didn't look at look as much um, they didn't look as much as the Pokemon that I th wanted it to look, but. 
But doing it on the computer gives you time to, like, f- fix it without having it look sloppy, like a, you like when you do it on paper. So, so I make sure to look at the picture and try to give it a nice pose where it, it's, like, pointing in a different direction, and I have it do angle out. I try to make it look like it's cloth with the shading, so... It looked like it was twisting a bit, so while well, I was doing the little head pat, because um, like when it comes to ghost Pokemon, I never had really, I never really had a uh, a fairy ghost Pokemon. So when Pokemon Sun and Moon came out with Mimikyu, I kind of love it because it looked like a Pikachu. Uh, before I knew it was like that was just a cloth it was wearing. I don't know, it just looked pretty cool as being all mysterious with the little Pikachu cloth over its uh, body. Uh, I don't know, it's just pretty cool itself. And then Lin is like one of the coolest fire Pokemon I ever had in the game playing Sun and Moon. Like, I, in in the real world, I like cats because I, I have a pet cat myself. So, having both a fire cat, it was cool to run around with in the game. And evolving it to, to Incineroar was the best thing uh, it evolved into. Like, having a Luchador cat fighting for you. I don't know, like, uh, with the posing, most of it I just made up myself. Um, the I think the hardest thing on Mimikyu is get it, making that that uh, that shadow looking thing that comes out of its body coming like looking like like the one in the pictures. I was trying to draw it from memory just when it comes out, but I don't like how it came out. It was a little difficult if you saw in the video. It was like trying to get it look, look looking right. Because, I don't know, like, Mimikyu is just an interesting Pokemon to draw. Oh, I'm still wondering what's underneath that cloth it uh, it's wearing. But when uh, when I did came up uh, with the, at the end when I was finishing up the drawing, I just thought I'll put in a background just to not just put like the average color background I put each time so I should try to put a little effort into the background try to make it look like they be- they it was like part of the uh, they were part of the background and I don't know like they'd be walking through a path where a lot of bushes are at because like in Pokemon, there's a lot of bushes in the game. Sometimes Pokemon hide in them. Some of them, sometimes they don't. Sometimes you get berries in bushes, but now you get berries in trees. Yeah, and then sometimes Pokemon fall out of the trees to attack you in the game. So, out of the aura surrounding the. Uh, Mimikyu is supposed to be purple, but the way it's behind the grass may look like it, it turned blue, but I don't know. That's, that's just what happens when you do that type of stuff. Um, but it, it, it turned out pretty good with the with everything together like that. It was, sometimes uh, it's hard to match up the colors. Even though when you do put them in the picture, they sometimes the colors may look off. Like sometimes one side looks lighter than the other, but you did use the same color. But no, uh, it's just sometimes colors look weird. But I, I had fun drawing this picture on Saturday. 
I would draw more like the draw, draw pictures like this uh, with Pokemon. Um, I am gonna try to draw my thumbnail for uh, Pokemon Continual Destruction Z from uh, Black Star Studios. Uh, his game. I'm gonna sh try to do th a thumbnail for that. But I'm gonna have to tr draw how I would uh how would I would look like coming back to Unova for the third time. Because uh, his game U Unova looks far different. I I I had to ask him. Uh, what's the time gap in that game? Um, but back to the picture. <laughs> I I ran the around. Around, I lost track of what I was saying. Um, um, I'm pretty, I'm, I'm pretty good how I finished off the picture. Uh, I, I did like how I shaded uh, Mimikyu and Linton. I like the effects I put in on them. So, uh, I, I'm pleased that you guys will, will like seeing it when it's done. Like, the finish one is going to be posted after this video is posted and while I'm streaming. But I hope you guys like it. It was a lot of work. Try to um, finish something for a video and show you guys the, the finished product of it. But I, I'm I'm still learning when it comes to art. Um, getting better in my anatomy. Uh, getting better at coloring, shading. Um, picking up different techniques in drawing. Trying to mess around with different styles. Messing around with different art programs. Because uh, a while back, um, I started messing around with uh, Paint Clip Studio. I'm gonna keep messing with it a little more, and also mess with also with uh, Photoshop again uh, Flash because I want to try to do some animation I can also animate in a uh, clip studio I also have to with clip studio I have to learn a little more how uh, how the animation uh, uh, tools work on there because they do work a little different than photo uh, than f how if you are animated in Photoshop or Flash Yeah, and um, I might do a speed art of uh, my Five Nights in Anime thumbnails. I haven't finished yet, so you might, you guys might see that later on. Cause I haven't done it. I just start lying it. Um, I don't know. Like, if you guys have any ideas for me to do a speed art on, just uh, just leave me uh. Just leave me a uh, just leave me a comment down below if you want to if you have any ideas what I should draw as a next uh, speed art picture if you want to see more because I, I like doing these and I uh, when I don't have uh, too much things to do like when it comes when I don't feel like uh, rec recording a uh, g gameplay for a game I'm let's playing. Um, yeah, that's, with that said, um, I hope you guys like the picture. Um, you guys have any ideas, leave me in the comments below. Uh, links to each playlist of what I do, with each Let's Play or other things I do on my channel in the, com in the, I said comments, in the description. <laughs> If you want to join the Freedom Necker, that's also in the description below. And let's see what else? Uh, if you want to follow me on Google Plus down there, if you want, uh, I think I'm gonna put my Twitter link on there too because I keep forgetting to do that. But if you want to follow me there, um, if, if you want to subscribe to see more things I do. And like it if you, if you want to like it, share it. With your friend, like share with your friends. That's up to you. But 
um, I have more things coming uh, into my channel soon. You guys want to watch. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.